today is gonna be a long day. So what's happening guys, it's your boy Wayne Ashley and today, today, today I am sitting on the ottoman that I shoot all my photos in. I shoot most of my product photos on this ottoman here, this here ottoman and another ottoman on that side. Those ottomans have made my photography so much better, I've gotten me a few gigs with those. These two Ottomans have gotten me a few gigs. I paid 40 Rand for them. And what I do is, I shoot all my photos, because I love that dreamy look, and I shoot all my photos whilst on, on these Ottomans. So I use them as my, my, my prop. And it's always been, if you, if you follow me on Instagram, you can check my Instagram, it's down on the bottom. Um, my photos, I spend most of my time on these Ottomans, I lay out everything on the Ottomans and I take a photo and they're all close-ups. So all my product shots are all close-ups. So I think today we're going to be taking a look at something um, that has nothing to do about product photography, has nothing to do about Ottomans, but has more to do on the daily photo, more to do on the, the daily photography that you, me and everybody else does and that is Getting your horizons right. Now, when I say horizons, think of it this way. When you watch The Lion King and you saw the sun pick up from the ground, from the earth, and that horizon, the ground that the earth, I mean, the ground that you saw there, the sun picked up from, from the ground and you can see that bright light, that surface there, the surface, the line, that divides the sun and the ground is called a horizon. And I think that is one of the basic things in photography that we need to look at and get right because if your horizon is not straight, it makes you look like you, you don't know what you're doing. But I'm gonna show you a quick way to do it and you can do it in your phone, you can do it in your in your in Lightroom, you can do it in Photoshop, you can do it in so much and now these phones have the ability to edit if you click onto your options uh, tab on the right and right and top uh, you'll be able to just go there to rotate and you'll be able to rotate it and and obviously just edit that that uh, horizon and make it straight so i'm going to give you an example of editing your horizon and making it how much of a difference it can make in a photo and add a little bit of professionalism into your shots so whether you're a phone photographer, a camera photographer, a DSLR, anything, even if you're shooting videos, make sure that when you're in editing your photos or even better, whilst in camera, make sure that you do one thing, is that make sure that your horizons are straight and make sure that you are close to your horizons being straight. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Welcome to Adobe Lightroom 2018 and as I said we're going to be touching on horizons and the most important thing about this image here is that the horizon is, is almost straight in camera but not straight in post-production and we're going to try and fix that up using the, the tools in Adobe Lightroom 2018 and I had the privilege of taking out this, this beautiful photo of a really beautiful couple who requested for my, my photography skills on the wedding day. Um, what a beautiful personality both of them have. And yeah, so the first thing that we're gonna take a look at is that it is a cropping tool in Adobe Lightroom and also in Adobe Mobile um, Lightroom. So if you do have uh, a smartphone, you can get your hands on Adobe Lightroom. You can just 
choose it in your Apple Store or your uh, Play Store or you can use other after other alternative stores especially if you're on Huawei they have it there as well and in in the mobile app you will also get a option to choose a cropping tool which is one of the first options in your phone and by doing that you are able to crop an image to the size that you want to crop it in maybe you want to crop the image to be much more closer to the subject or you want to crop it to make it look like it's in, in the sixth um, so that's all entirely up to you so for me I think I'm gonna to stick to how the image was in the beginning and then the most important thing is obviously keeping in line with getting the horizon straight so if I click on the side here right here after choosing the option of cropping you will be able to adjust the rotation of the image now this image if you look at it properly it is looking like the, the ocean is falling towards the left so we want the ocean to be perfectly straight and especially when the subject is in the picture you don't want them to look like they're leaning towards the left so by just adjusting this and pulling it down you can automatically see that the ocean or the horizon is now 100% aligned with the photo and it gives this the, the, the groom a perfectly centered look and also gets the couple perfectly centered and that's my my, my whole point of, of this you know you want to just focus on on simple things like that when you're editing a photo whether it's in camera um, or in, in, in your phone you want to use the, the cropping tool that is made available to you to get those horizons you know perfectly straight so that they make a big difference in, in your photos and you can see you you know you take your photography seriously and you you are able to you know you've got a bit of an upper hand as compared to the other phone photographers or DSLR photographers whether in pre or whether in, in post production or in camera so that's about it it's still just a, a simple tip so just just to remind you is that you need to click on the cropping tool and adjust it back to how you want it to be um, also remember that the cropping tool can be used in another way if you want to crop the, the image or to rotate the image. In actual sense, we are just rotating the image to match the horizon. Okay, so my name is Wayne Ashley. Thank you for watching another episode of Comfort Shooting and I am out.